Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. Hello, great to have you with us. And this is the scene here at the Lusail Stadium, just to the north of Doha. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's France against Denmark. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris begins in goal. Benjamin Pavard plays with Theo Hernandez in the wide defensive areas. And up front, Karim Benzema plays alongside Kylian Mbappe. And the starting lineup for Denmark. Kasper Schmeichel stands between the posts. Andreas Christensen starts alongside Simon Kerr in central defence. Thomas Delaney plays alongside Christian Eriksen in the centre of midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And now they get the ball rolling. Ericsson. Oh, lovely ball. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Yusuf Fofana. Well, considering the form book, Stuart, Kylian Mbappe has got to be taken seriously here. Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goal... Must be! And it goes! That will do nicely for starters. First goal of the game. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. He skips past his marker, and that gives him the space to get his shot away. Excellent stuff from him. Goal. So, back underway. Will there be a response from France here? Chouameni. Now, Rabiot, good move in the making from France, but nothing comes of it. Mbappe. And great work to confuse the defender. Could be! Well, fantastic reflex action. And over from Ericsson. 
and clearing it away. Eriksson. And unable to keep the ball. And they do like to press whenever they can. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Defended well. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. doesn't get away with it free kick given <laughs> Benzema watered by the post well threat over for now well they were so close to the equaliser there they're certainly a bit unlucky, but they need to make more of these chances. Yes, a really open flow to the game. End-to-end -end stuff. Really good challenge. Eriksson. Now Thomas Delaney. And a chance to whip it in here. Excellent defending. Well, the counter chance looks very real. And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Well, foul play, says the referee. He goes short. Vass. They've got it scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. Underway with the lead standing at 2 0. Griezmann. Havar with it. And return to Benzema. Can he get one back? He can. He's given his team a real opportunity. And momentum is with them. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. So the ball is moving once more. And I'll tell you what, France are right back in this contest now. Aurelien Chouameni. Now Rabio. Return to Rabio. Griezmann. And he was in the right place to intercept. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. Griezmann. That is that for the first half here. Well, the verdict on Kylian Mbappe, in a word, positive. Yeah, he's done okay in that first half. He's had a lot of the ball, he's used it well, and he's been energetic. But I'm...
So into the second half, can France bounce back after that first 45? And Benzema in the middle. Well, a bit short with the clearance. That is not going to do. Well wide of the target. Damsgaard. Kasper Dolberg. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Could be a chance to break here. But they took care of the situation defensively. Oh, good vision. I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Well, that's what Christensen is all about. Good read. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Breaking at pace. But the danger averted for now. France looking dangerous here. Benzema! The crossbar got in the way. And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. Time for a change then. An opportunity to level matters. The keeper going in the right direction and saving it. Let's see about the delivery. Magnificent stuff, and quite the comeback from two goals down. Well, here's the replay. It's certainly a well-delivered ball into the area, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. there were many who had counted them out this has been quite the fight back Pavard a chance for him to get in behind maybe Karim Benzema Well, we can see it again now, and it all starts with the pass over the top. It takes out so many defenders. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? 
Just 15 minutes remaining. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Pavier. Ericsson. Good visualization and execution. Ericsson. This could level it. And all square now. And you have to ask the question is the time for either side to win it? Well, let's look at this again. And the keeper just lost his bearings there. He was never in the right position. He won't want to see that again. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Kylian Mbappe. Well-timed tackle. They're on the scent of a winner late in this game. And he really read that brilliantly. Coman. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. And just like that, the counter-attack comes to an end. Oh, that's an interesting pass. And Eriksen in a promising position. Oh, dealt with... And he succeeds in scraping it off the line. Coman. Karim Benzema in the thick of things. What can they do from this corner? The minutes ticking away in this game. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. He's driven in the corner. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. So the referee brings this contest to an end. A draw here, not exactly what France had in mind. Stuart, your overall assessment. Well, Derek, it will feel like a defeat in that dressing room. They had the game won and were in control, but they just couldn't see it out. That's a real blow to them. And in the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Stuart. Well, he did everything right today, didn't he? He was outstanding in front of goal, but it still wasn't enough to get the victory. Some of their defending was really poor.